Did you know that Windows XP users have an FTP client built into their Windows Explorer? Today I'm going to show you how to use it. First of all, what you're going to want to do is go to my computer. Uh, and then you want to get the address bar. So if you don't have it, you're going to want to go to view and then toolbars and then tick address bar. What what you're then going to want to do is just type in an address of any FTP server. Um, so I'm just going to go to my server. And then you will get this this box. Even if you log on, in on, on anonymously, then you can obviously take the log on and anonymously. But you'll, you'll still get this box anyway. But I'm gonna just type in my and hopefully um as you see these are all my files and i can uh copy any file off i can download any file sorry as you just saw there i can delete any file i can do what if Ever you do something to do with an FTP client, and obviously I can, obviously I can upload files. <laughs> and y yeah. And I can change the permission of files. And um, here it has all the permissions. So yeah. Um. So yeah, that's that's quite a good F FTP client. Um, built right into your system. I would recommend trading it one hundred percent for a normal client because. I can't get this particular server to remember my password because there, there is an option um, to remember your password but I don't know why but when I try it it's, it's blocked out so w when you try this it might not be but um, if I when I do it does so yeah that's how to access an FTP client on your computer now um as you can see here or i hope you can see i have a shortcut and it goes to my ftp server we just w wait for the windows explorer it, it goes to my ftp server and i'm not gonna i'm not gonna log in again because it will just take way too long but um basically how you make a shortcut is just like making any other shortcut you right click on your desktop and select shortcut um and then you, you, you're gonna just type in the url of your ftp server so, as you've already seen mine, I'm, I'm just going to pretend that I own the, ser I own the server at youtube.com or I want to try and access it. Um, YouTube. Dot com and that'll that'll do the same for any url which is the url of your 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 server that you need to be entering there 
or any server that, that you want to access. And as you see, I've got that shortcut to YouTube here. And I, so I'm just going to click it. And it'll it'll take a second to load because of, obviously it's got to uh, tap into the FTP server. As you can see, it's it's come up when you um do create a shortcut, it yeah, treats it as an internet shortcut, but you can still um do that. I'm just gonna try this again because it didn't work. I I I think it's because. Anonymous users can't access the server at youtube.com But trust me it does work because you, you saw the other FTP shortcut working So feel free to try this out on your system And uh, see how it works for you this, this could be a substitute for an FTP client so it's one less download you have to do next time you set up your computer. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, comment and rate. Thanks again.